Alright, so it's November 27th, um, it's 9.48 a.m. And I, um, I'm currently getting ready to go for the COVID vaccine. I will be taking Moderna and um, this is my first dose. So obviously I'm going to record and document my process. I will do the second one as well. And you know, if anything happens, anything changes. Currently, <clears throat> my body is fine, like feeling fine. I have a slight headache, and I know that's because I haven't eaten anything yet. So I'm not counting that as anything. Um, what else? I know my skin is very sensitive. So if anything is to happen to my skin, I'm definitely gonna say it's that. Because right now there's nothing like on my skin or whatever. Um, but yeah, I'm feeling fine. I have a slight cold. This is all prior to going for it. Um, yeah, but I've been kind of, you know, it's flu season, kind of coldly feeling for the past maybe a week or so. Um, again, if anything comes on more than it has been or should be, I would say that's where it's from. But I'm just documenting that, you probably. So, you guys are going to see all of that stuff, and I'll probably do like, you know, after two hour time or something like that, three hour, four days, whatever, whatever, just to have it, you know, show exactly, if there's anything to show anyways, how I'm feeling, experience, and all that stuff. Um, yeah, so come along with me as I go for this vaccine. I know y'all are here minding my business, so please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And turn on your post notifications so you do not miss any uploads from me. And follow my social media pages always on the screen in the description below. And please stick around for the rest of it. And I'll see you guys in a bit. So basically I went to Shoppers Drug Mart. If you guys live in Canada and you do know of this place, I booked it online. Um, you select a time, the vaccine that you're getting, and the dosage. If it's like first, second, or whatever. Um, and the first thing you do, you have to fill out this form. This is basically putting in your health information and stuff like that. And asking you stuff based on if you had um, the vaccine, like the dose one or whatever. So that's basically it with your address and email and all that kind of stuff. Hey, man. Movie too, huh? <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Yeah. Relax. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. You are on movie. Hey. Hey. <laughs> what do you do? Uh, what, what, where you work? Yeah, you work in somewhere? You don't want to know it. I gotta take it away and yes. take it Okay. Just drop your shoulder. Just relax. Just drop the shoulder. Drop. Just so tight. You have to drop it. Relax. Otherwise, you wouldn't have pain. I huh? like it. Alright guys, so welcome back to this part of the vlog. Um I just got back from like, taking my second dose of the vaccine. Um yeah. As you guys would have known from the beginning of this video, I started recording my process of doing that. This time I went by myself because um <laughs> it basically was for work. Honestly, the reason why I'm doing it, and because of I work with kids and whatever, I had like a priority of a specific location to go or whatever. So I went there. Um, yeah, and that's pretty much it. So I went to the place this morning. My appointment was like 11:35. You had to book appointment online. They didn't even ask me anything about the appointment. You know, just your IDs and stuff. And it was so crazy because I went there and um, the lady's taking my information and she took my health card whatever and she's like okay is this your first dose? I'm like no it's my second. Like she asked me what I took and all that stuff I told her. She's like we don't there's nothing in there for, in the system for you. She finally found my information. She told me oh the health card number was um it was incorrect in the system. I don't know what it was so basically it was showing that i wasn't even like i didn't even take the first dose that's basically what it was like are you fucking kidding me how can you do 
how can you not do your job for something this serious and i'm like i started i was going crazy i'm like so i need to what do this again because that's not fucking happening and i was ready to lose my shit because that's ridiculous yeah but i was ready to lose my shit and i'm just like wtf right anyways she figured out what i guess she solved it i don't know um this time when i went i didn't really get to take much clips it was it was like in a school i did do a tiktok so i'm gonna edit that tiktok and put it in this video at the end so you guys can see because i think i got more clips for tiktok than i did filming wise because it was kind of easier to do and today i didn't bring my camera actually um yeah it's approximately like two hours or so since i got it i feel normal there's nothing happening um i'm not sure how much i i updated you guys since the first dose but i was fine it was just really sore for like two three days or whatever but that's about it to be honest um, yeah that's about it i didn't really have no symptoms or anything i must say like it's just really the soreness most people complain about this second dose i hope not i don't have any reaction or anything but this is the reason for me doing this so you know you guys will be updated depending on whatever happens but as of now this is two hours into getting my second dose and no i'm not in a hurry or i have not thought about a booster no it took me like over a month or almost two months to actually go get the second one and i was not honestly if i was not working or i didn't work in this field or whatever i was not trying to take that impossible but um yeah that's about it so i will it it actually doesn't hurt like the first one my hand was sore like instantly i remember it was like hurting like a lot i must say though actually something happened the first dose when i took it the second day like the sunday because i took that saturday as well i was actually pretty drowsy like i felt so sleepy i mean maybe it's not that but then i realized today literally once i took it i felt drained i just felt drained. my body just felt like drained so that's why i remembered what happened with the first dose and i'm like okay maybe that's the thing that's happening so it could be i don't know comment down below if you guys know of a symptom like this you know if that happened to anyone it happened to you just let me know at least i would know okay maybe it's from that and not just my body feeling tired but i definitely feel the my body like being pulled down kind of thing but um so far that's it and i'll keep you all posted i hope you guys have enjoyed this was somewhat informative to you but I can only say and I'm being as honest um, as I possibly can based on my experience. I'm not gonna go out there and say things that didn't happen to me or whatever. Even if I knew it happened to someone else, it didn't happen to me. I am speaking from my experience and I hope you guys appreciate that. You know, even me sharing about this. Because you know, it takes a lot. Especially for someone like me that didn't even want to do this in the first place and I did. So, yep. Um, and that's about it. And I will see y'all in a couple of days. Call me to shoppers to get my COVID vaccine. Um, I took Pfizer. First thing they have you do is fill out these forms. I don't know why they ask you the same questions. They're going to ask you again anyways. But they um, have you fill out a form. Then I went inside, still answer your questions. And then he was trying to get me the vaccine. But my hand was so tense. Honestly, I was nervous. Then I had to go to the second location to get my second dose. And this was in the school. It was really jam-packed. First, you have to um show her card line up there then this is where you register and then this is me letting you know how i feel felt um after the two i don't know where the volume for this is but i my arms was really tense and um i just was really drained and drowsy to be honest that's the um experience i had and i got sick after so yeah um i don't know what my advice was.